Hello Taurus and welcome to your coffee cup reading for the week of June 5th and this is a quick and general reading. Taurus. Beautiful energy when it comes to breakthroughs. There will be, for some of you, um, an awakening and a wake-up call. So I do see that energy. Um, more certainty. For some of you, will be embarking on a new enterprise. So I do like that energy. But it's kind of polarized, so watch your emotions this week. For some of you, you're balancing your yin and yang, so that's good. There is some sadness here and negativity. Some of you may be dealing with some kind of loss um, and grief. So that is um, showing up for others. This is just um, negative thinking. So you kind of bring yourself down because you have more of a balance this week. You know, it's your yin and yang should be balanced for most of you. So I'm seeing that energy there. Yeah, this is a week of so a lot of you getting emo emotionally balanced. You could be giving other people advice, people coming to you for advice. Um, but this is also talk and counsel may be needed. So seeing that kind of energy could be dealing with in the Pisces and Aquarius energy is showing up. For some of you, this is starting to date um, a new friendship. So it's something that's building that does take time. I do like that energy. Nice surprise for some of you. I do see wish fulfillment, but it does come with a delay. Okay, delving into prayer. And this is spir spiritually being fortunate. So I do like that energy. I am seeing here. You could be a little bit anxious. A little bit cautious. Some of you are dealing with some kind of insecurities. All right, so it is a week of kind of like um, watching your self-esteem, working on it, and instabilities. And something is wrapping up here. I do like that. Perseverance is very important. Now, I do see two's company. Three's a crowd here, so someone is sticking their nose in your business. For others, this could be in your love life. All right, so I do see that, okay? Kind of tricky, especially if you're starting to date. It could be a complicated relationship. For some of you, this is your friendships. Um, and there's like the oddball here. Okay, it's almost like two's company, but the three's a crowd. So I do see that energy. For some of you, I do see you making some kind of adjustments and uh, doing things differently, and it's going to bring you better results. So this is like making adjustments and um, patience. For some of you, there could be some major decision that you want to make, but. Um, it's like tweaking things and kind of weighing out your options. I do see that this is a good week for, um, it's like ending the week or it's restoring your balance. For some of you, this is dealing with court and there could be maybe a continuance or some adjustments with some kind of a deal. So I do feel that energy as well. Maybe dealing with contracts and officializing something this week as well. It looks positive. There is a very special message here about noticing your, I want to say, your reoccurring physical and emotional feelings. This means like, what is your body signaling to you? Uh, what are your emotions telling you? Okay, because they kind of signifying divine guidance. So kind of work with that too this week. All right. So a lot of talk, counsel, um, Communications is definitely showing up here. There could be someone who could be very helpful and very understanding this week too. All right, so I do see that um, energy as well. For some of you, could meet a doctor or someone in the medical field if you're dating. Or for others of you, this is um, um, somehow coming into focus. Um, yeah, maybe some of you want to study medicine. I don't know, but... Me um, Medicine in medical field is definitely showing up here too. And this is a significant a, um, person showing up too. It looks masculine. 
but it doesn't necessarily mean so. The number three could be very important for you this week as well. For some reason, I'm seeing that um, energy too. And 11. All right, Taurus, that is your reading for the week of um, June 5th. Have a fabulous week. Talk to you next week.